Hey everybody, Kelly Ritchie here. Welcome to The Cutting Edge. It's August and we're going to continue our series on Modes Made Easy. We kicked that series off last month and our focus was on the Aeolian mode. This month we're going to look at the Dorian. Now, I'm a blues, blues rock player and I'm all about pentatonics, but I've always sprinkled those extra two notes found mainly from the Dorian and the Aeolian mode. Okay, so we're going to look at those. And last month we looked at the Aeolian and I used as an example a chord progression that went from an A minor 7 to a D minor 7. It went on to the G7 suspended to the G. But let's look at the A minor 7 to the D minor 7. That note right there leads us to our Aeolian. This month, we're going to look at a real Santana-ish, where we go from an A minor 7 to a D dominant 7. Okay? Now, there's a section in the channel called Modes Made Easy. That's where you're going to find these lessons, okay? And I'm going to be continuing to add, like I did last month, more and more videos, okay? I'm really going to build this section out with a number of rhythm tracks for the Aeolian and Dorian. I'm going to put in a good mix of each. Now, when I started the series, I decided to also include a whole section on pentatonics because that's what we're adding those two notes to. So I wanted to break down the pentatonics and all five fingerings that people tend to learn and point out how I use two and then the roadmap that I have in expanding those. It allows me to play the pentatonics up and down the neck using my first and third fingers only for power and for speed. So I taught those on an electric and on an acoustic in the key of E and the key of A. So wherever you are in your learning process, make sure that you know your pentatonics because that's what we're adding these extra two notes to, all right? Now, with the jam tracks that I'm putting in, I have a whole Let's Jam series where I take the rhythm track for the song, I play a few verses of rhythm, then a few verses of lead, and then it's all yours. That way, when you come to work on that song, you've got a rhythm track to play to, but you can see me playing the rhythm and the lead to give you some ideas, okay? So I'm doing the same here with Modes Made Easy. So be sure to keep checking back because I will be adding more and more of these. I'm also adding the jam tracks to my YouTube channel. There you can see the thumbnails and scroll through things, sometimes a lot faster. But here in this channel is where you're gonna find the tab and the rhythm tracks that you can download, okay? All right, now don't forget that every month on the second Wednesday at 8 p.m., we do a live Zoom call. I record those, so if you're not able to make it, you can always listen to the replay. You will find the link for our Zoom call and all of the recordings in the folder that says live Zoom calls, okay? So have a great month. If you wanna pick up a one-on-one -on -one private lesson or if you wanna sign up to work with me on a weekly basis, it's available. Okay, have a great month and I'm here if you need me. All right, take care.